Discover Qatar has added back the visa on arrival option on its website. Remember, when we are talking about the visa on arrival, remember, there is a mandate that was supposed to come into effect on the 14th of April regarding the three nationalities. And those nationalities that we have to talk about, their uh, nationalities, we are looking at people coming from Pakistani and we are looking at nationalities coming from India and nationalities coming from Iran. Remember, in that degree, the nationalities coming from this country to get the visa on arrival, they needed to have what you call a hotel booking that is being done in advance. Remember, at that time, before it was, uh, before, when it was announced, uh, after one day, uh, Discover Qatar removed its option from the website. Or website. There was a lot of controversies why, and a clear information was not given why it was removed by that time. But as talking right now, the option has been added back to its website on the Discover Qatar. Starting 14th of this day, we are looking at the visas on arrival. What are the options for the visas on arrival for people who are coming to Qatar? Remember, when we are talking about the visas right now, we cannot fail to mention what we call the FIFA World Cup. I know all things must be rotating around the FIFA World Cup entry itself. But the three nationalities right now, before they had what you call the visa waiver, uh, and normally the visas on arrival for those countries, they have what you call the visa waivers with these countries. So for now, these three nationalities, they need to have what you call a hotel booking. And that hotel booking, you, they are supposed or they are supposed to have done it on what you call Discover Qatar. Because under the Discover Qatar website, it is there are a list of what you call the hotels that are being chosen by the state of Qatar for you to book a particular hotel at that time. And what does it mean right now? That the booking of the hotels is going to start immediately using what you call the Discover Qatar uh, website. What does it mean? If you are a nationality coming from Iran, if you are a nationality coming from Pakistan, and if you are a nationality coming from India. For you to access the visa, for you to approve your request for the visa on arrival in Qatar, you need to have booked a hotel for the period of stay you are going to be in the country. Hope I'm very clear. If for example you are going to be in Qatar for six months and your visa is for six months, you need to have paid a hotel or you must have booked a hotel discover Qatar and strictly for those six months for any extension also the extension has to be uh, has to be indicated if your visa is to be uh, to be extended in any format remember for the list of the hotels that are those website they will give you different charges or they will give you different prices according to what you can afford at a given period of time but remember for you to have the visa approved on arrival you will have to present what you call a voucher you will have to present a voucher that is coming from the discover Qatar in one of the hotels that you booked your stay at that time and this and this also includes for those that are applying for what you call the family visas. Also, if you are applying under or if someone is applying for you under what you call a family visa, then still the same procedure that has to be followed and the same procedure they need to book for you what you call a hotel for that period that you are going to stay. Those are the latest, the latest updates and the latest news that are always now now. So what I have to let you now know guys, if you're coming from those nationalities, I just want to let you know that the booking for the hotels on the Discover Qatar as per the government and per the, per the Ministry of Interior for you to have what you call the visa on arrival, then you need to have that hotel booked. And what does it mean? what does it mean to you that you must calculate yourself or you must calculate your period accordingly in that way that you do not have to lose out in any format that form because the period of stay will probably must be matching 
to the same um, period that your visa you are requesting. And furthermore, the, the Ministry of uh, Website, Discover, uh, Discover Kata website, still indicated that the Ministry, on the Ministry of Interior website, or on the Ministry of Interior um, uh, website, you can still find more other requirements for other types of visas and the hotels from which you can book your stay as you are coming to apply for the visa on arrival in Qatar if you are coming in any of those nationalities at hand. This is really, uh, I would say, good news was in whatever format. Remember, still further, the Minister of Interior says that for those people that coming are coming from these other countries, maybe back home, and you are planning to come, you can as well book from wherever you are or from your country of origin and discover hard cutter hotels. With the number of hotels or with the number of services uh, in different hotels that are uh, legally uh, that are legally linked to Discover Qatar, where you can still access the booking of the hotel, such that you don't have to, to get it out from when you come within the country. Hope I've tried to share something for you. So the mandatory hotel booking for the visa on arrival is on, starting this day today, which is the 14th of April 2022. You need to book up a hotel for you to access the visa on arrival if you are coming from those nationalities I mentioned, that is India, Pakistan, and Iran. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel and thank you so much for coming back home. Watching all these updates, I appreciate. It's Max from the Max Creation and see you again in the next video as we try to see more of the 